Hi here, Fins here. I'm back for another video and today it's time for me to react to the songs that are trying to represent the Czech Republic in the Eurovision Song Contest 2020 in Rotterdam, um, I say Rotterdam, Amsterdam, Rotterdam, the Netherlands this year. So yes, seven songs have been released, um, and I'm very, I'm looking forward to this because I've got high hopes for the Czech Republic. They've had a great last couple of years, so let's keep this winning streak going uh, through their national selection that they do online. And I'll be voting for the first time this year on the Eurovision app, which I'm very looking forward to. There's a couple of returnees, um, so yes. So let's get started uh, with one of those returnees, Barbara, I'll try and pronounce her surname, Mokwa, 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 um, apologies. Um, I remember that she was, I describe her as the Lana Del Rey of the Czech Republic. <laughs> Because I remember her song last year was very Lana Del Rey, and it was one of the favourites. A lot of people wanted it to win. Not me personally, but... <laughs> Our song this year is called White, White and Black Holes. Trapped in slow, okay. time here, with a lightless way in mind. Don't know why Yeah, it's very Lana Del Rey. You could really see Lana Del Rey singing. She's got a beautiful voice. It's very <laughs> Lana Del Rey. Maybe it's a bit too Lana Del Rey for me. Sorry. It's very beautiful. She's got a very nice voice to her. And I do feel if the Czech Republic did have a live national selection, she would slay. <laughs> It is very much like a song last year. But I just worry, it is very one note, if you know what I mean. But it is very beautiful, and I can see juries getting behind this more than the televotes. I have to say, I prefer this song for her this year compared to last year. Oh gosh, she's got a really nice voice. Like, oh, okay, maybe she could. Oh gosh, she's screaming now, actually, maybe, no. I would tone down the screaming a little bit, but it's very pleasant. This has potential, I feel. Yeah, I, I feel like that song would have quite potential in Eurovision. Um, yeah, I would. it's nice that she did um, raise it up at the end, so yeah, I see potential on that. I do think she's improved since last year, so, um, but let's see what the other songs bring. Uh, next is Ellis Marva with Wanna Be Like Me, Wanna Be Like, no, Wanna Be Like, oh, and it's featuring Chris T, I presume. No, 
Oh, I don't want the advert. No, we can't play that. Right, there we go. I wanna be low, cause I wanna pull Ooh. it down. And you can be low, who baby turn around. And this is what I do, baby. This Ooh, is she's what got I like. Sets, just go. I like it too, but I like to spend the night. We can pull it down, yeah. Oh, yes. It's summer in January. I like this one. See, I think televotors would get this more than jury. Just the other way around with this song. I like this one as well. Good voice. This has got a good beat to it. It's very radio friendly. It reminds me of Megan Trainer. But maybe with a bit more sax, I would say. So many ballads. I quite like that one. I see potential as well in that one. It was very radio friendly, very fun, very upbeat, very up tempo, very summery. Yeah. Um, but let's see what the others will bring. Next one is Carili with At Least We've Tried. Okay, now we're going back to the ballads. I don't mind 
this one. It does feel like a ballad I've heard before, but it's sung beautifully, and live, it will ele hopefully elevate. Um, if it does go to the ocean. It's not bad. I do feel like it's a ballad I've heard before, but it's a ballad that's quite nice to hear. Um, but yeah, that wasn't. I quite like that one again. This hasn't been a bad song yet, which is a good sign. Oh, next up is Pam Rabbit. She's the other returnee to this national selection. Now, Pam, I remember last year, um, sung Easy to Believe, one of my favourites last year for the Czech Republic. And also the year before that, she was also, I found out that she was a backing vocalist um, for Nicholas Joseph in 2018. So hopefully she'll, fingers crossed, do something good this year. Her song is this year is called Get Up. Interesting start. Ooh. Where am I going? Okay. Okay. Ooh, is it Halloween already? <laughs> In the Czech Republic? Bowman, but the female version, if you know what I mean. It's Rag and Bowman mixed with a little bit of Billy Elliot kind of music, if you know what I mean. This is interesting, this is experimental, I'd say. It's such a shame the Czech Republic doesn't have a live show. But I like that she's not playing it safe. She's taking risks. Yeah, this is another one I like. The Czech Republic's doing well this year. I think she's improved. I could see this winning out of the four songs I've played so far. But yeah, I really like that one. But anyway, that's part one of the Czech Republic, me reacting to the Czech Republic songs. Part two is coming up very shortly, so I'll see you there. Goodbye.